Good morning, good evening, good day, everybody. My name is Mortis, and welcome back to Amnesia. No, I don't have too long to record this episode, so let's try and get into this as quickly as possible. I think my microphone is going to be working properly again, which would be good. And the room is vibrating, so I'm going to try and get out of here. Um, oh yeah, we, I remember now. We broke the uh, thing. Is there anything else I can use? I apologize if my face cam... Oh, wooden crank. <laughs> That's useful. Is really white, but my camera... Oh, there we go. Is refusing to uh, do it properly. What's it doing now? Oh, okay. I'm just going to leave it. I'm just going to let it do whatever it wants to. Okay. Here we go. And back to the sister. The purpose of the inner sanctum had always been to study the orbs and find a way to force them to yield their power. However, he was still unaware of this. Okay, so what happens here? Ah, that's, uh, that's stuck. Got any more mementos here? Nope, none available. Okay, then. Wait a second, what if we put this up really high? Wait, it is that one, isn't it? There we go. Oh, shit. And then what? Does it just come back down again? I need to study this, because I think I'm going to have to go up on that one and then jump across. Like a noob. And probably break my legs in the process. Well, that's going to come back down again, isn't it? Are you? Yep, there we go. So, we've got to put it up and then run and jump onto it. Okay, here we go. Put it up. Run. Jump onto it. There we go. So this will open up and then we need to sprint jump onto the top of there. YOLO! Oh, fuck. Ouch. That was not intelligent. I should have waited till it was at the top. Ow, my legs. My legs are in, in... Oh, God. They're in quite a bit of pain here. What's her health at? Barely conscious. All right, we're going to have to use one of these. Oh, we're still bleeding quite badly. Fuck. All right, put that down. Put it down. Oh, God. I can't believe we missed. We actually missed. That's... That's terrible. Right, up, and then sprint... If we miss this time, we're dead. Basically. Here we go. We're gonna wait till it's right at the top. We might actually be dead anyway from this height. Ow! Ow, my legs! My legs! I'm barely conscious and I don't have any lad and add them. I don't think this is going to go well for me. Into the morgue. Perfect. Alexander knew there must be a way to finish the ritual before it was too late. He had to teach his friend to harvest the vitae. That much was certain. Okay, here we go. Let's try and complete this little bit. Oh god, this, this doesn't look fun. How am I doing? That's crystal clear, but I am nearly dead. 38 tinderboxes, Jesus Christ. Oh, yes, that will give me more health. Nice. Do you see, Daniel? It has yielded. What? The shadow. It has? For now. Come, let's get this out of here so we can get some peace. Yes, let's. Where to? Just down the corridor, to the morgue. Oh, love Are there more dead men there? You did well, Daniel. Come, let's get going. Oh, well, ain't this great. 
Did that give me any health at all? Yeah, it did. Wound is bleeding quite badly. That's... That's better than it was before. Shit. Oh, thank God, another one. What? What happened? Why are all these dead? Where am I? Mr. Hammer! What's happening? Help! Anybody! Help! Mr. Hammer! Oh my god, I thought I'd lost you! Tender box, come on. Come on, buddy. Come on, awesome. Come on, Mr. Hammer, where are you? Jerry, Jerry, leave him alone. Gerald! Three days now. This is ridiculous. Indeed it is. this room! Anything else? Help! I'm so tired. If I sleep, but I'll wake from this nightmare. No, you won't. If not, I pray my heavenly Father will take me in my sleep. Well, thank God, we must have a lot of health after that. No, still bleeding quite badly, and we've got a slight headache now, which isn't good. Come on, come on, Mr. Hammer. Oh, I. I thought I'd missed you there. I thought I'd lost you forever. Hi, Mr. Mouse. How's it going? Come on, we're gonna... We're gonna do this together. I'm sorry, but if the monster comes, I am gonna throw you at his head. I hope you will defend me with honor. Because we are true friends. And that's what true friends do for each other. Come on, just open the door. Oh. Oh, it opens that way, okay. Oh. Come on, Mr. Hammer. Come on, sit down here with the nice naked man. With the small penis. I hear you breathing, Daniel. Do you hear me? Have you changed your mind? No. Hey. See what's in this note. The vaccine enabling my men to work in the fungi-ridden sewer is a definite success. Unfortunately, only a few of the servants have been remedied as the procedure proved difficult. The others will perish and eventually I will have to create more of them to keep my experiments running. Note that an injection of vaccinated blood will work as a shield long enough to pass the sewers without any risk of infection. It will do fine for prisoner transport. Awesome. Oh god, not another one of these weird shit things. I fear for Daniel, for he is reckless. He is tainted by the approaching shadow and will not be able to pass the end of the gate. Will he be able to accept this in the end? My love, I've seen him, I've seen evil in him. Now am I to trust him with the truth? What cruel irony that I have to do unto him what Agrippa did unto me. Well, that was weird. That was very weird. Right, anything else? Tender box, nice. Boo. Oh, another note. The strange death among the servants and the prisoners have finally been resolved. It seems that the drain sewer, which has been recently been opened up for use as a means of transport, is plagued by a peculiar poisonous fungi. The victims seem to have suffered an extremely quick outbreak of sickness, affecting the entire body. Some of my men, including myself, are blissfully spared by this calamity but it is clear that this cripples my progress. The prisoners die quickly and the contaminated Vitae lacks the energy I seek. I shall immediately start working on a vaccine. Okay, so he said he's got a vaccine. I just need some blood. Take it I need to get some blood from this guy. How though? Have I, can I just like stab him? Okay, that's, that's, that's not working. What about in the head with this knife? Ah, okay, that's not working either. Have I got any things I could use? Oh, okay. Oh my god! That's what I actually need. I need to do that. That's cool. So, hammer and chipper. Cannot use item this way. Hollow needle. There's something missing. Oh, maybe... <coughs> okay! It cannot penetrate the skull. Um... Hand drill. 
perfect. Oh, well, that's a bit weird. That, that is a bit weird. Oh. Oh, great. The hand drill broke. Ain't that perfect? So, oh, I need to use my pot again, don't I? Here we go, my glass jar. What? I can't use the item this way. Oh. Ow! Okay, I'm just supposed to stab it into my hand. Oh, God. Creepy noises. Well, Mr. Hammer, we're leaving. Ow. Well, Mr. Hammer, you're coming with me. Like, stay here. I'm gonna go and investigate. See if there are any tinder boxes just lying around. In any of these, there probably will be in one of them. Tin boxes. Any in the first? Oh, there's a nice guy there. Hello. Diggle, diggle feet, diggle feet. Well, this is nice. Yeah, this is quite nice. No tin boxes, though, unfortunately. Come on. Come on, Mr. Hammer. We're going to investigate this further. Oh, this isn't very nice. Alright, stay here. I will take care of the situation. See if there's anything worth salvaging. Doesn't look like it, just looks like two weird piles of dead bodies in a room. A very moist room. Okay then. I guess it's time. Oh god! Mr. Hammer! Protect me! Mr. Hammer, I left Mr. Hammer, no! Mr. Hammer! Oh god, oh god. Oh shit! Come on, Mr. Hammer! Hide! Don't break into the, this room, please. Please! Leave me alone. Wow, what's wrong with me? How I got... Oh, my Santis. <laughs> A bit fucked. Oh, God. I'm not liking this. Oh, God. This is really not cool. Come on. Is he gone? I think he might be gone. Oh god. Close the door. Ow, I am dying here. I'm literally dying. Oh, come on. Well, that was weird. Head is pounding and hands are shaking. So I guess that's what happens. If you <laughs> go in totally insane. Is he gone? I think he's gone. I'm going to leave that door open in case, though. Mr. Hammer, you survived! Of course I survived. I'm awesome. Fair enough, Mr. Hammer. That's cool. Come on, Mr. Hammer. We need to get out of here. I know, I know. I know you know. I'm just, I'm just making sure that you know. That we need to escape. Because it's pretty shit in here. Honestly, it is, it's absolute bullshit. Okay. Sorry, Mr. Hammer. I'm gonna have to leave you again. That's okay, that's okay. Just, just go on. 
I will. I will complete this mission for you, Mr. Hammer. I will do this. I'm sure we'll see you at some point. Mr. Hammer's a very nice guy. He's a he's a very nice guy. But anyway, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Um, I don't want my mama coming in again and tell me to come off the computer. So that was quite quite scary at the end. But we found Mr. Hammer and we have found a way to get through that water. All we need to do is sort of drain it somehow. Which should be pretty interesting. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed that, don't forget to like and subscribe. It would be really awesome if you could share it to someone. Facebook, Twitter, Google+, wherever you want to share it. Thank you for watching. See you bros next time. Bye-bye.